OK, look how we've modified God rest you merry gentlemen. First of all, we've put in another repeat sign, a beginning repeat sign. Two lines with the two dots. And it's after the anacrusis. It's after the upbeat note. We don't need to play that again because that note appears now just before the repeat sign at the end. So if I play between the two repeat bars, I have simply got... That's the first time through. Then we repeat, back to the repeat sign, and we play again. But this time, we don't play the first time bar, we miss it out. We play the second time bar instead. This is to save us writing out the thing all over again, just to change the final notes. This is a very common procedure. First and second time bars. They always come together with repeats. You play up to the repeat, which means playing the first time bar. You go back and play it again, but take the alternative route, the second time bar. So the second time bar, you'll notice, is slightly different. I'm going to play the whole thing for you. Repeat. So first of all, you'll notice that we're playing two notes with the left hand. It's the bottom line and the middle line. There they are. That's an interval of a fifth. One, two, three, four, five. So the left hand gets to play two notes at once there. So you'll notice the second time bar is very similar to the first time bar, but it's different enough to warrant writing out again. So this is what we've got so far. Repeat. Now that last note, obviously on its own, is an anacrusis, an upbeat, for what's going to follow. So, over to you now, it's your turn.